So a couple months back, I decided to clean this 2.5 gallon tank because the dwarf water lattice was pretty much overrun in this tank. So what I did was I took almost pretty much maybe three fourth of the dwarf water lattice out of this tank, and I do them in the compost, and I kept ten of the best looking dwarf water lattice and I put them back in here and I mean it's not really complete fail but just about in one month they have pretty much almost completely come back um, it's filling up very slowly but it's coming back now since I keep a glass lid on this tank the evap seems to produce uh, water droplets so there's tend to be water droplets that are on top of the dwarf water lattice as you can see here and they tend to be on top of here sometimes it's actually a pretty bad thing because sometimes the water actually the water will kind of you can say kind of dry them up or melt them away because I noticed that if there's water droplets on top of them there seems to be uh, the leaves seem to kind of welt away so like that one right there the yellow leaf there so there's another one there so it's just that at once I keep my lid on you get kind of evap but if you keep them in an open top tank they shouldn't be a problem so yep yeah. so here's the roots of the dwarf wall lattice now I use a sponge filter so they, they, the roots themselves don't seem to get damaged but if you keep them in a very high let's say a uh, in the back filter they do the roots do kind of break off and it, they're kind of fragile so once they break off it might take them a while to recover back so in about a month or so, this 2.5 gap thing should be completely covered with dwarf water lattice. Uh, in this tank, I don't usually do any sort of water change. Um, most of the nutrients usually come from the the food that I feed the snails. So I mean, if there's any leftover, they do produce some sort of nitrite, so the the plants do absorb those. And here's a shot of the current. You can see it, the sponge filter and it, it doesn't really produce a lot of current in the tank. Uh, 